In 2015, Bernie Sanders woke me up. My openly gay six-year-old transgender nephew wanted something different than most kids for his birthday. He wanted the COVID-19 vaccine for the greater good of humanity. Because unlike the racist Republicans, he wanted to protect our democracy and take on his social responsibility to do his part for the greater good. He is now gone from this world. He recently had a heart attack. But the doctors say they don't know what caused it, but I know what caused it. It was a stress from the Donald Trump supporters and the science deniers. Racist, bigot, homophobe! You might recognize this man as one of the most evil men, if not the most evil man in history, is what you call him. But I have somebody who is much worse. His name is Donald J. Trump. Now let me tell you why Donald Trump is worse than Adolf Hitler. Number one. Donald Trump hurts my feelings, and Hitler does not. Number two, Hitler at least put people in quarantine camps and made them wear masks, while Donald Trump continues to spew out Russian disinformation. Huh. Third, Hitler had the decency and kindness to kill himself. Meanwhile, Donald Trump is still alive. At least Hitler had the decency to leave us alone. Trump, on the other hand, refuses to kill himself and makes him significantly worse. <laughs> now we're in war with Ukraine and Russia. If we had a nuclear war, it would be worth it if it could just save one life. looking for a shirt for my six-year-old openly gay transgender nephew after I got off work at Starbucks where I'm a barista. But at least I know that I was helping the LGBTQ community while Brianna Taylor was killed. Every and night I lay on my pillow and I pray that Dr. Fauci that's would make a vaccine for white supremacy. I hate myself! Thank you. That's your time. Appreciate it. <laughs> well, <laughs> Could you do that over there so we can get the next person?